Hey everyone, my name is Fergus and I am currently in the 30th cohort of the data school within the information lab. In this video, I will be introducing you to the distance tool within the spatial category. The distance tool is used to calculate the distance between a point and another point, line or polygon. This may be useful when calculating distance between two cities you may wish to travel between. Okay, so we'll jump straight in. We have two data sets here. We have the store ID and we have the customer ID and some points that we want to sort of calculate the distance in between. So each store to each customer. First, we want to create points. We only have the longitude and latitude uh, for, our, for our IDs. So we want to create centroids in order to conduct uh, further analysis using the spatial tools within Ultrix. So we'll drag one in for each data set. Automatically, they will pick up the longitude and latitude if it is input correctly. So no, we need to change anything on the configuration pane. Next, we want to join what we have together to be able to calculate the distance by the data being on the same row. So we'll select the join tool here, add that and connect both anchors like so. We want to connect the store ID to the customer ID. This is the common field that they that um, they have in common. Um, we also want to remove any unnecessary fields. These ones that are being renamed, because otherwise it just clutter our, clutter our data set. So if we can just remove some of these by unticking them, uh, we can also once we have the centroid, we can also remove the the longitude and latitude. I will rename this one to customer. And this one can be store. Android. Just to update this, we'll give it a run. And if we click on the J anchor, we can just see our output briefly. Oh, we didn't actually include that one. Okay, so now we have our two points. We can now add in our distance tool. So if we go over to spatial, hover over distance, drag that in there. And here is our configuration pane for our distance tool. So here we just want to select the two points that we want to measure the distance between. So in this instance, we want to select the store and the customer. Uh, we can leave this as the default and also we just need to select our personal preference of what we want the units to be in whether it's miles kilometers obviously i'm i'm from the uk so it will work in miles and also it gives you the option to output cardinal directions so it could be north west south east as well so we'll leave that ticked so if we select run now We'll add a cheeky browse tool in for good measure. And here you can see the distance in miles for each point there, and also the direction it goes in. So yeah, there you have it. Uh, so I hope this video has been useful explaining how to calculate distance in Ultrix. Um, feel free to just subscribe to our channel, uh, The Information Lab. And also click on the thumbnail in the top right to see our newest upload or the bottom right to see any related videos. Thank you.